Qatar has accused its Gulf neighbors of breaking international law by hacking government websites and planting false information that helped cause a continuing diplomatic rift in the region. According to the Washington Post, U.S. officials discovered last week that ministers from the United Arab Emirates held a meeting on 23 May to discuss plans to hack Qatari government news and social media sites and post incendiary false quotes attributed to Qatar's emir, Sheikh Tamim bin Hamid Al Thani. Qatar Diplomatic Crisis, What You Need to Know Read More The Alleged Hack, which involved disparaging remarks purportedly by the emir about Donald Trump, praise for Hamas and support for Iran as an Islamic power, took place the following day. It preceded the current split in the Gulf between Qatar and a coalition of four states, the UAE, Saudi Arabia, Egypt and Bahrain, that are maintaining an economic and diplomatic boycott against it. The group imposed sanctions on Qatar on 5 June, cutting diplomatic and transport ties with the tiny Gulf monarchy after accusing it of financing militant groups and allying with their regional foe Iran. Doha denies the accusations and says Thani never made the remarks. The Qatar Information Office said, the information published in the Washington Post revealed the involvement of the United Arab Emirates and senior Emirati officials in the hacking of Qatar News Agency. The report unequivocally proves that this hacking crime took place.